guys merry christmas so i thought what would be a better way to gift you guys than to gift you guys with a christmas makeup look tutorial so here is a christmas makeup look where i'm looking like a christmas tree myself if it is too over the top for you then you can of course tone it down i personally can rock it anywhere so if you want to see how i got this look then please keep on watching <laughs> I started by applying a uh, Smashbox primer water all over my face and then moved on to my eyes first where I'm applying Pro HD eyeshadow primer in black by LA Girl. The black primer is gonna give a pop to my colors, you'll see how. So here I'm looking like a panda and just blending it out using my finger and then for my crease color I'm using Wattles by Colourpop. This is a light nude shimmery shade. I'm buffing it into my crease. And then for my lid, I picked up this bottle green color from Morphe 35S eyeshadow palette and packed it on all over my eyelid till my crease but not going beyond wattles. And then taking a clean eyeshadow brush, I just merged the two colors together, buffing everything in and leaving no harsh lines. For my inner corner, I picked up this icy green eyeshadow from the same palette and popped it in my inner corner to give a pop to my eyes and then glitter. Now, I'm loving glitter lately. I, mean, like, I know you guys have been notice noticing but I think Christmas look is incomplete without glitter so I'm applying this bottle green glitter which I picked up from a local store and I loved it. So I'm packing it on all over my eyelid. I had applied glitter primer by NYX first to have minimum fallouts and for my brow bone I applied this icy white eyeshadow from 35S Morphe palette onto my brow bone cleaning out any fallouts and clearing the edges of my eyes to give me a sharp cat eye look I'm now gonna apply an eyeliner using Colourpop uh, Ariba this is an ultra matte lipstick and for the very first time I had used a lipstick as a liner and I'm in love so to tight line my eyes because we don't want any skin to show through I'm using Plum Everyday Wear Kajal in my uh, upper waterline and then using NYX the skinny mascara I am applying a coat of it on my upper lashes in the downward motions because that's how I do it before applying my false lashes which are from PAC these are the mink lashes in number M72 I'm gonna apply them and then give another coat of mascara to my lashes just to merge my real ones with the false ones you guys have seen me doing it a thousand times Moving on to my face, I'm applying Fenty Beauty Pro Filter Instant Retouch Primer. I had applied smash water, smash water, smash water over my face just to hydrate first and then a layer of primer. Then some liquid illuminator by NYX. This is going all over my face just to give me that natural glow which I don't naturally have. For the foundation, I picked up L'Oreal Infallible Stay Fresh 24 Hour Foundation. All the shades and numbers will be mentioned in the description box below, so don't worry, open that up. For my uh, under eye area, I am applying Gotcha Covered Concealer. This is like a high duty concealer, so thick, but the coverage is so beautiful. It's so easy to blend and give such a natural look. I really suggest you to buy this concealer. I'm setting everything in using Laura Mercier loose setting powder. What a buttery piece that is. I just love it. Contouring, don't be afraid to dazzle by Tarte. I'm using this contour and highlighting palette first picking up the bronzer shade from it and adding some color back to my face. And while my face is baking, I'll fill in my brows using Wet n Wild Color Icon Brow Pencil in shade Bruna do it better and then moving on to my highlighter before applying the blush because this is a technique I'm loving lately I'm just applying a lot of highlighter all over my face because of course I want to look like a Christmas tree so yeah it's going all over my face and then I'm applying Strictly Chic this is an ombre blush by NYX onto the apples of my cheeks just to get a little bit of blush because my eyes are so bold I don't want anything else to speak for me 
I'm filling in my waterline using Wonder Pencil in Medium by NYX. Yeah. Just to open up my eyes a little bit. And then picking up this red eyeshadow from Day and Night Eyeshadow Palette by BH Cosmetics. I'm buffing it in to my lower lash line. I had no clue I was going to apply a red eyeshadow right there. But that looked so good. Then a little bit of black eyeshadow for Morphe 35S eyeshadow palette just to you know give a little depth to my eyes and then a coat of mascara on a, on the lower lashes not just a coat two three coats to complete the look i then applied colourpop ultra matte lipstick in ariba which i had used as a liner onto my lips yeah because red lips is a must and because I felt my lips were looking a little too left out, so I applied Vices by Wet n Wild. This is their single glitter uh, eyeshadow, and I applied it just in the centers of my lips. And that is the final look, guys. I hope you will like it because I totally love it. Seriously. So, yeah, I hope you will like it. If you do, then please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And yeah, I'll see you guys in my next video. Thank you so, so much for watching. Merry Christmas, and I hope all your wishes come true. Um, yeah, I'll see you guys in my next video then. Thank you so much for watching. I love you guys so much. Bye.